Hey, Just Bricks here with another haul video. Um, kind of combining a couple of hauls, hauls together. I never did anything about these on here, so I figured I'd go ahead and just show you what I got. I picked up these two sets here about a week and a half, two weeks ago from the Lego store. I had a uh, $20 reward from VIP, so I went ahead and used that. They had it where if you spent $40 on uh, Lego Harry Potter, you'd get this poly bag free, so I got that. And I also managed to pick up this guy. Uh, they still had some of those left, and so I got both promos. I also picked up a couple minifigures, but um, I haven't... I, I don't have those here right the second. So these guys are already listed in my store. These I'm going to be parting out. I, I kind of wanted to get... A complete set of the Patronus uh, animals in my store. I have the deer already um, and I wanted to get at least one each of this the otter and the rabbit in my store. Um, I also wanted one for my personal collection since I, I like to collect the animals. Also I picked up three of these classic sets, set 11717. Uh, very large set good part out value. I picked up three of those from a, a Walmart the other day. I was in Delaware where there's no sales tax, so I went ahead and picked them up. And the part of the haul I'm most excited about is this right down here. Um, this box is actually, it's pretty hilarious. This box right here, I think, is just about the lightest thing in the entire haul video today. In fact, let me get my, sale, my scale zeroed out. Okay, 3.6 ounces, 0.4 ounces, and okay, 8 ounces, but I'm pretty sure this is from Lego. I ordered, I, I placed an order with Bricks and Pieces the other day, and that part hasn't shipped yet, but I believe that this right here is the rest of my order. Yep, Lego shop box. Oh look, bubbles. And a sticker sheet. I actually didn't mean to order this. Uh, I kind of placed it in my cart. It, it didn't really cost me anything because I wasn't getting free shipping until I added this because for some reason the parts and pieces didn't count towards the $35 for free shipping until I added a different item to my cart. So this was $1.99, shipping would have been $2.95, I believe. So basically I got that for free. And the last thing from this order. Yes, I have wanted one of these for quite some time. The chrome red VIP minifigure keychain. It's a very good deal there on the VIP rewards page. Um, only a hundred points for this keychain. I think you can only redeem it twice. Um, I still have to place my second order so I can get my second one. Um, I'm probably gonna keep this guy. He's really cool. I really like that chrome red. Lego, we need more chrome chrome colors. They're awesome. All right, we'll go ahead and order this. This is from, uh, I believe, Joback Toys is the, their username on Bricklink. I placed this order a couple days ago. Well, a couple days ago. Uh, over a week ago. It just came in. Two pieces in my order from their store. Let's see if I can get this open. Helmet for a uh, Iron Patriot. I have the rest of the figure, just missing that helmet. And then I got this top hat that I wanted to have for my Western. I got a $35 minifigure. Well, I think I have to rebuild the neck bracket and. Uh, I believe it has a gun over the shoulder on him. I'm not positive on that. I've got to look that up, but either way, it's a very good minifigure. I believe he's $35 average sold price on Bricklink used. So 
very glad to find that in a used lot. Especially with the face mask, because that's the most commonly lost part. I had I had this helmet, but my uh, my nephew visited and got a hold of the box of Lego that he was in and that he came in at my uh, at my mom's house and yeah that didn't end out <laughs> turn out too well all right and the last order is from just a brick in the bucket quite a little hefty container there probably mostly because of my little instructions these were free I really liked the uh, the fact that they were the vintage Hard to say vintage when I remember getting these sets for Christmas when they were new. But, oh, there you go. Thanks, just a brick in the bucket. And I got a, quite a few of these. Well, five of them, I think it was. I am um, not quite sure what I'm going to do with them. I just thought they were kind of cool. I remember getting sets from this time period. And, in fact, I believe I had... I don't think I had this one. I had one that was a little bit bigger. I know I had this alien, and he was my favorite of them. <laughs> Got some dark turquoise pieces there, and some of those two by six bricks that uh, they've been asking us to buy. I think most of them are sold now. So I got some, uh, well, I got a Dalmatian, some bright light orange heads, some orange heads, some eyes, a bunch of eyes for my brickies. Let's see, I got a, I think that's a, lavender head some a bright light pink some dark bluish gray heads um, got that fish there from my animal collection all these pieces I got from my own collection I didn't really have an idea of buying them to resell but um, actually the I guess the eyes technically are for my store I use them for my brickies mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna do these green minion eyes. I think they're minions. They look like minions to me. <laughs> oh, you got crazy eyes. There we go. And we got a brickie. He looks a little ridiculous, but I love making the different brickies. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and make a brickie out of one of these 2x6 bricks. It'll be a very, very tall brickie. And I think I'm going to use the squinty eyes. It's going to be a little suspicious, of, a little suspicious brickie. And this is a whole lot harder to do with only one hand. brickies <laughs> so I got some more parts for more brickies for my store I got a bunch of these dark turquoise bricks what's kind of funny is I purchased all these dark turquoise bricks and I didn't think to check my store and make sure I hadn't listed the ones I had for sale so literally the same day I bought I think I bought 10 each of the 1x3s and 1x4s Literally the same day I bought those, I sold like three of each from my from my store because I'm silly and forgot to check and make sure that they were, weren't in there. But anyway, I got some more dark turquoise bricks and I think that's just about everything I got. Oh, nope, that didn't work. Maybe it'll balance better on the bricky. There we go. It's a dapper bricky. <laughs> and so there we go. I think that just about does it for the haul video. So I got all these parts. Oh yeah, there's my uh, another one of the brickies for my store. Some of, sometimes with my orders, I like to send out uh, a brickie. Each one's a little different. Um, this particular one came from a used lot that this brick was pretty much destroyed. So I decided to put a couple weird pieces on there to make him kind of uh, funny looking. <laughs> I made him my, uh, I call him my Neanderthal brickie. In fact, if you follow me on Instagram, there's a picture on there from a trip I took down to Tennessee where he's being eaten by a 
uh, T-Rex. Kind of funny because it looks like he was biting on his head, making his eye pop out. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, it's just something fun I like to include in my orders. And yeah, that should wrap up this video. Um, thanks again to Just a Brick in the Bucket, and I, I looked it up. It's actually uh, Jonak Toys. I think I got it right that time. Uh, it'll be on the screen. But thanks to uh, Just a Brick in the Bucket for the sale they did for Labor Day and if you haven't been over there go ahead and check them out on Bricklink and got some really cool pieces all in all a pretty awesome haul uh, until next time y'all have a good one this thing's still in our living room still not quite sure what I'm gonna do with this boat <laughs>